Okay. I am here with somebody that I met 11 years ago who walked into Free Bikes for Kids and said she wanted to help. Her name is Deb Fortner. She, uh, she probably will downplay her hero status, but I think she's a superhero. You don't see a cape on her right now, but I know there's one there hidden somewhere. So Deb, how are you? Great, thank you. <laughs> so you have a story. Tell, tell us about what you've done and how you've gotten involved with Free Bikes for Kids. Well, I worked, uh, I worked with Alina and I got involved when there was a volunteer opportunity to help out with the collection sites um, and then collecting the bikes and then helping with cleaning. And once I got involved with the cleaning, I just, it's just such a great, great organization and a great mission that they, so it really hooked me. Yeah. So then what, what happened after that? You decided you thought you could do more than just clean bikes? Well, yes. After it took me about five years to figure, well, I can I can find some bikes for the group. And so I started my first year. I just collected bikes from a couple of the neighbors and some families. And I found I got nine bikes. And then the next year I thought, well, I could do a little better. And I started collecting a little few more. And I think my second year I got 48 bikes. Um, and then I've just kind of continued collecting finding different ways of collecting bikes the last few years. So last year, so what did you collect, like 100 bikes last year? Uh, last year, I managed to collect 902 bikes. 902. And you did this basically by yourself. Well, I had my daughter was helpful in finding some bikes for me. Tom came up with some bikes for me. So I, I did have some help. So 902 bikes. Where did you put them? Well, fortunately, we live in a very secluded um, area where we've got some trees. So we've got them on pallets underneath uh, tarps in, in our backyard. So your yard was a used bike shop. That is true. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And, and Tom was okay with this? Tom has been, he has supported me every step of the way. Um, and he's very involved as well you know, helping out and, and uh, um, feels that this is just a wonderful thing to do. Yeah, you guys have been both volunteering for over a decade now, so it's amazing. So, okay, you got 902 bikes last year. So did you decide, that's it, I'm going to retire? What, what's happening this year? Well, I'm not retiring. And um, so, so far this year, I've collected a little over a thousand bikes. Um, it's still going strong. We have a few more. I, I, I collect year round now. And I find that people, once you've made contacts with people, they can't keep contacting you back. Are you still so um, it's grown to just a little over a 1000 so far. Are you called like the, the used bike lady or do, do they well, have names for you? I the, the crazy bike lady. <laughs> <laughs> I, I would say the beautiful bike lady. Oh, well. uh, anything that you would say to people out there that, you know, about, I mean, are you superhuman or can, can other people do what you're doing? Oh my gosh. It just, like I say, it started out for me. It's just like, I, well, I think I can find some bikes. And then um, the more there's so many sources of bikes out there, I kept thinking, oh, so anybody can do this. I mean, really, truly, I, I had no idea when I started this that it would grow into such a, a, a passion for me. And it really, it really doesn't take, you don't need to be superhuman to do this. Well, you may not be superhuman, but you're a, a superhuman. You're a, you're a wonderful person, Deb. And, you know, I know that Tia, the executive director of Minnesota Free Bikes for Kids and, mm -hmm. and you know, 902 kids last year, if they met you, they would give you a hug and a thousand and however many you end up with this year, you know, you, you are a hero to those people. And, and I, yeah. I applaud you. Thank oh. you for all you have done. And all of you out there who are watching this, this is what an, an individual who cares and has passion and some drive can do. So um, let's, let's see if we can find our Deb in all of our cities.
So thank you, Deb. Thank you. All right. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. All right, bye.